there's still this stupid political issue about bike lanes being a a, um, a wedge issue in politics and it, it's so dumb so many places that in toronto that i would never have ever considered riding my bike and now i'm like oh this is so weird i feel so safe here i don't understand it it moved fairly quickly so i like i think that's why like i keep having this optimism that mike doesn't seem to have i keep thinking that it is possible that at some point in my life we don't have to just you know campaign to fix those the traffic rules and then wait 30 years i'm like I, can't they get better faster absolutely they can it's mostly political will because building it this way is cheaper um there are times when you see these like crazy bike lane projects that cost millions per kilometer and stuff but guaranteed every single time it's because they've rolled in a bunch of other crap in there like some extra new surfacing for the roads and new uh, water pipes or something like that that's been thrown in and just called part of the cycling budget. The truth of the matter is building this way is cheaper, um, significantly cheaper. It's cheaper to build to begin with, um, but it's significantly like orders of magnitude cheaper uh, in the long run. Like 